everyone welcome back to my channel so today we are going to discuss the problem flattening a link list so in this problem we will be given a link list of size n where every node represents a sub link list like if this is the link list right each node is further a link list right and contain two pointers each node will contain two pointers a uh, next pointer which it which usually always every node has and one extra pointer which is bottom pointer bottom pointer see like 5's next is 10 but 5 bottom is 7 so bo bottom pointer to a link list where the where this node is head uh, this 5 is head for this bottom link list each of sub link list in sorted order all the sub link list if you see these are in sorted order 10 20 19 20 50 these are sorted order so what we need to do is we need to flatten this link list such that all nodes appear in a single level while maintaining the sorted order means we need to make this whole all the all these nodes uh, in a single link list which is sorted itself so this is our aim let's see how we'll approach this problem so let's see what we need to do basically we need to make this as single link list we need to make this as single link list right need to make it as single link list and it should be sorted and it should be sorted now it is already given that these these sub link list like this link list this link list these are sorted in itself right now if what we can do like if we can somehow merge these we'll get one single link list now if we merge these two sorted link list this is sorted and this is also sorted right this is sorted and this is also sorted so if we merge and we know how to merge two link list merge two sorted link list we know that if you don't know how to do this i'll recommend to watch previous video i'll uh, give the link in the description merge two sorted link list so the this link list and this link list when we'll do we, when we'll merge them so it will make a single link list which is sorted in itself so these two sub link list will make one link list and then this link list will merge it with this one so these two will also make one sorted link list so this link list which is uh, made will we will merge it with this one so this and this one will make one single link list which is sorted so in this way we can approach this question how we will be using previous concept of merging to sorted link list why we thought of this because these these sub link list are itself in sorted right they are or, or they are sorted so also we need to make a single link list of all these nodes so what we can do is we can turn by turn merge any two link list and in this way we will merge the entire list entire all these nodes so let's uh, dry run this approach once uh, let's uh, dry run it once so first of all uh, let's uh, let's see uh, let's see how these will merge like if 19 we have 19 22 and 50 and we have 28 35 and 40 and 45 so these two are sorted right these two are sorted see 19 20 50 is sorted 28 35 40 45 is sorted in ascending order so what we'll do is we'll merge them we'll merge these so what does merging means merging just means combining the nodes of these two link list but in sorted order that means 19 will come first on merging these two link list 19 then 28 uh, no 22 will come because 22 is less lesser than 28 then 28 will come then 35 then 40 and then 45 and then this 50 so this will be created after we merge this and this so then what we need to do once we get this head 19 we will merge this link list with this link list right so the conclusion which we get is that this merge this merge sorted link list now this sorted merge sorted link list it's head its head which is 19 should be present after merging should be present in this tens next here this should be connected with this so that in the next turn this and this thing is sorted being sorted right and this 19 this 22 is connected to 19's bottom 
bottom don't confuse it with next it's not next this pointer will be bottom why bottom because something this will be made after after this na after uh, merging tens next this tens next will contain 19 22 then 28 like this 28 35 40 and 45 and 50 so earlier the two link list the two sub link list which were sorted we merged them and we made a new link list like this so this is further a sub list now now what we will do is we will merge this one and this one so after merging them what will it uh, they will become are uh, it will be something like 10 then 20 will be there uh, no 19 will be there if we merge these two then 20 will be there this one 20 then 22 then again select 35 40 45 uh, 45 and 50 so and these two will get eliminated and and this 10 this 10 will be connected to this fives next here like this then last what we'll do is we will merge five with five this this whole sub list which whose head is five with this sub list whose head is fives next fives next which is 10 so this link list and this link list will merge them and finally we'll get the merged link list which will be 5 7 uh then 8 then it will be 10 then it will be 19 and then 20 28 and then so on like 30 and then this 35 and 40 and if all below right so this is how this question will approach it but now one more uh, doubt we, which we will have is that okay we will be merging like what we got from this approach is as of now so now as of now what we got uh, from this approach is that uh, we will be taking two link list at a time and we'll be merging them so if this is link list a and this is link list b we'll merge a and b right we'll merge a and b and whatever the new head we get new head we will uh, place it in this one let's say this is c c is next will get updated c is next means here it will be new head whatever merged head we got so this is as of now what we got from this approach but now how we will do it recursively why recursively you will see so in recursion what we have is uh, because every time you see na there is repetitive work see there is repetitive work how you will know that if there will be using recursion because there is same repetitive work same that is every time we take two link list we merge it then the combined uh, link list which is made by these two we'll take that and we'll merge it with this one then that one and this one so this is repetitive work so we can use recursion so in recursion what we have is we have base case right we have base case we have small work and we have recursive call these are the three steps which are uh, in every recursive problem recursive call right so let's see how we will approach this using recursion now the concept will be same so now every time whenever you think of recursive call na you need to know, you need to think of how you will divide your problem divide the problem into sub problems divide the problem into smaller problems let's say and say into smaller problem smaller problems right so if we have like let's say uh, we will pass this thing to recursion fives next that is here this thing we will pass to the recursion and we'll ask recursion that just give us the sorted merged sorted link list of all this So what recursion will do? Recursion will give us ten, or like the merge merge uh, link list, the combined merge link list. That will be ten, nineteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-eight, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, and fifty. So recursion will give us this head ten. So now what 
in this way we will be dividing our uh, problem right we will be passing let's say this is our head so we will be passing in the recursive call let's say we have function flatten we will be passing heads next to the recursive call heads next and heads next and we will expect something that this flatten function what we it will return it will return the new head of the merged linked list so that we need to put in heads next heads next so that they that like this merged this uh, merged combined linked list it uh, its head is in fives next here right so this is one step after that what like if suppose this fives let's say fives next fives next is connected to this 10 that 10 is in fives next like this now what we need to do we need to merge this to this and this so then the second step that is our small work this was our recursive call small work will be merging so merge what will merge head and heads next head and heads next heads and heads next that means head 5 and heads next 10 so these will merge and we will return whatever new head we get whatever this merge will return merge will return the new head merged head like the uh, the head of the merge link list so these are the two steps first of all this is a recursive call and then this is the small work and base case is simple right always we will be requiring two link list we will be requiring two link list to merge right it's common sense right we'll be requir requiring two link list to merge so uh, if we are at the last over here if we add the last link list means if this 28 next is null 28 next is null means we are at the last link list so just return simply return this link list because we can't merge it with anything now we need two link list to merge so we will just simply return so i hope you got the approach a uh, high level idea uh, I, I have tried to like make it easier for you guys but let's see the code you will understand more with the code so i in this video i'll be explaining python code and uh, if you got the approach right it's very easy to convert python into c plus plus now it's not a big deal right so first of all in the question we'll be given flatten function and in this problem i'll i will not be explaining uh, i will not explain the merge how to merge two sorted linked list i hope you will see the previous video and you can get through that so uh, this function will be given to us flatten and root of the this linked list that means this five will be given this five so right so a uh, simple base case is always that if root is none then return none otherwise if root is roots next is none means we are at the last link list like if we, we are at 28 so 28 next is none means just simply return this return this sub list like this thing because we can't merge it with anything right so and then what we'll do is uh one second yeah so then what we'll do is we will do our recursive call so in the recursive call what we do we call flatten function passing heads next right so what we'll do is uh, we will be cause, uh, calling this flatten function this is a flatten i think flatten right flatten function and uh, we, uh, we will be passing flatten roots next right roots next means flatten we will be passing heads next let's take uh, head as root here roots next and whatever this flatten will uh, return right whatever this flatten will return we will be the merging our root with that thing right that is merge whatever root is with this flatten whatever flatten is returning this this right so these are the two steps first of all uh, this just uh, get the rest of the like flatten call the recursive call it will give you the rest of this combined link list and then just merge this with the uh, this link list root so uh, this is the code for the merge link uh, merge list it's very similar to the uh, code which we discussed in the merge two sorted link list problem just the difference just the difference is that instead of next everywhere it's bottom why bottom because we are combining this we, what we are doing is we are merging this link list with this link list right so head is this one head a is this head b is this and this 22 is not 
in heads next heads next is this thing no we need to go to bottom of this so just the difference is that everywhere it will be bottom right so i hope you got this problem it's very easy problem uh, try to code it and dry run if you are not able to get it uh, and if you like the video please please like it subscribe to my channel and share it too thank you